So front end framework, so which one is the best and which one one should use? Uh, it's a very overwhelming question. Uh, and uh, to be honest, uh, none of them I would say is uh, the best and uh, none of them would be forever. Uh, uh, we have seen Java applets uh, in the history. They have been like pretty much uh, in every website, you know, then we have seen uh, Flash, ActionScript, you know, pretty much every website has that, you know. Uh, so uh, evolution is uh, inevitable, you know. Uh, so uh, uh, I mean, uh, these organizations really develop these uh, frameworks, uh, and if some individual uh, t uh, communities develop these frameworks like Angular, React, and Vue, and some others, um, and they are pretty good, you know. Uh, so uh, uh, what I would say, there were some benefits, you know. They these companies uh, develop in house, and they made it. Uh, public so one of the benefit was that uh, they reduced the training cost you know uh, uh, so and the other thing was they made it uh, uh, like they had readily engineers available and they can hire them and uh, make them uh, work on uh, the, uh, that particular framework but the point is uh, when organization stops uh, maintaining these frameworks uh, stops uh, uh, investing st stops uh, bug fixing and these things um, <laughs> things become all obsolete, uh, um, you know, and uh, so in no way I'm like against these frameworks. In fact, I love these frameworks. Uh, <laughs> I would say uh, use one of them. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, one of the major benefit of using these frameworks is that the code is structured and layout in a very particular f fashion, you know, and any new engineer who joins the team, he understands it. and you can easily develop on top of it and uh, the benefit is that you can even understand his uh, code base and you know how uh, he has written uh, his piece of work uh, i would say it's easy uh, like you can develop uh, uh, an application purely in javascript and html css but i would advise against that as an individual you might be like you know that's what i know and it's easy to develop yeah it's easy but when a new engineers will an engineer will join you uh, he will not figure out everything uh, even if it's uh, clear in your mind so it's uh, best to use one of the frameworks i would say it's uh, it helps them uh, help the team and as a, an organization to maintain uh, uh, this uh, code base very well one uh, thing i would suggest is when using these frameworks you're not obliged to use every single part of this framework uh, you know, m most of these websites, they rank that, you know, uh, this framework has these features, this framework has these features, and sometimes they just put in, you know, because they know that's how it would be ranked, you know, or something like that. And uh, I would say use as much as HTML and JavaScript you can uh, and use the framework features you really need. Uh, the result would be that in future at any time you need to switch to another framework. Uh, that will be uh, very easy to uh, do that and you don't need uh, framework specific people because they first need to understand that and then transform it to another uh, code base it's not going to be like that so html and javascript that's pretty much like common everyone understands and it will work way much better in that uh, aspect one exception i would say that's my personal thinking is let me know how you how you guys think is that if someone is like startup or you know they they, they are doing um, uh, some for uh, they have this um, MVP product I would say minimum viable product or you know proof of concept I would say uh, don't bother too much about these things thinking about these frameworks use whatever you understand whatever you are good with uh, if a founder understands and it has worked on React or a view or anything like that even if it's like jQuery just use that whatever works for you uh, because the main purpose is uh, get that um, idea out uh, as fast as possible uh, and don't spend like uh, years <laughs> to develop uh, just the POC or the MVP uh, it's not a good idea uh, let me know if something relevant I missed out uh, which is more important maybe I should have mentioned let me know. Uh, I appreciate that. Thank you very much.